Shore United Bank has been a strong backbone for both Easton and Talbot County. Offering a wide variety of financial services and options for its customers, Shore United has everything a person or business could need to thrive and succeed in their financial journey. Following the news of the merging of Easton-based Shore Bank Shares Incorporated, the holding company of Shore United Bank, and the Community Bank of the Chesapeake and Waldorf, we sat down with Scott Beatty, CEO and President of Shore United Bank, and Donna Stevens, COO and Executive Vice President of Shore United, and discussed the merger's impact on the bank, as well as the Easton community. Uh, we're the largest uh, independent bank on the Delmarva Peninsula. We've served our communities here for years. Um, I think, you know, we're of a size now where we can pretty much fulfill every need of, of most of the businesses and, and on the entire shore. Right now, we're in Virginia, on Eastern Shore, Virginia, uh, Maryland, Delaware. Uh, we're on the other side of the bridge, on the Western Shore. We have a very significant presence over there. Uh, this moves us into Southern Maryland and it, kind of the Fredericksburg area, this new acquisition. Now is a good time to expand Shore United Bank um, in order to grow with their communities. You know, our customers are growing, our customers are expanding, and we can grow along with them. In addition, we can provide the services as an expanded financial institution. We can provide additional technology and services that clients are needing. The idea that Shore United Bank is maintaining its headquarters in Easton, I think, is significant to the town and to Talbot County in general. We have about 200 employees here in Easton area, and we'll be able to um, provide additional employment opportunities within this area. Banking, you know, people say, uh, you know, you get bigger just to get bigger. We don't get bigger just to get bigger. Um, we're invested in our communities. Not, we're not in just the financial backbone of the community, but we invest in our communities. Our volunteer hours for all, all of our employees, um, you know, the amount of money we spend in donations annually. You know, the super regionals, big regionals, nationals, they take money off the Del Marble and they lend it in other markets. We lend your money in our markets. Strongest asset, you know, as a community bank is our employees. Um, you know, our employees are the ones that are out there. They're, you know, in the community. They're the ones that are servicing the customer. And if we treat our employees as being the key asset, then they in turn are treating the customer as the important asset. So we go hand in hand from a customer service perspective. We were also wondering if the merger would create additional need for office space in Easton. Well, all you have to do is look next door at the Hills building, <laughs> and I think you'll see that we have a need for additional office space. Yes, we do. Uh, once this merger is complete, we're going to be the, about the 150th largest uh, publicly traded bank in the United States and headquartered in Easton, Maryland. Which brings a lot of attention to Easton.